What's up guys, this is Philly Swords RC. Today I got a Hoss 3S Volcano 3S in the Big Rock. Yeah, this is going to be a little comparison today between the three rigs. More durability, which the red can is less durable than these two, but that's that's fine. Starting off with the volcano. All right, what's inside the volcano? We got the Sidewinder ESC and the Hobby Wing. Easy start. It's a 3652. KV motor, it's, um, factory servo, sac factory gears. It's uh, no, not factory gears. I got a metal slipper in here. That's why I got that little thing. It's kind of smooth. This system is real smooth. You'll see when I'm driving it. It's a very smooth system. Very smooth. We got my fly sky. Oh shit, not fly sky. I got my radio link, radio hook to it. Let's tighten that up a little bit because we about to bash. Yeah, we're going to run this one first so I, so I can show you how smooth this system is. Even though I didn't think this would be a good combination, a castle, sidewinder, and a um, hobby wing motor, you wouldn't think that's a good combo, but it is. This, a real, this thing is real smooth now. Also with the Volcano, I installed some lights. I got white in the front and red in the back. I ain't had this out in a minute. It's wow. I think 3S is a little much. Yeah, it's a little cogging up on me. Yeah. Oh, come on. I think 3S too much. I'm going to have to throw it on 2S real quick. Be right back. That hobby wing can't handle it. Yeah, I figured out what the problem was. It's the um, it's the motor can't handle um, 3S. That's the problem. The motor can't handle 3S. Only two. I thought it... Um, I thought it was the ESC earlier on, but now I see it's the motor. Let's see if she can handle some grass. Is she eating it up on 2S though. Surprise the road. Yeah, she can't handle gravel all that well. Can only handle two S. They got good hand. It's smooth though. It's very smooth. It came unglued again. Ah, up there go the tire right there. Oh, wow, it came right off the rim. The 
big rock. Ain't nothing upgraded on this except for the shocks and the wing. We got blue lights in the front and yellow and orange in the back. Yeah, this battery, this battery is wet. Yeah, this battery is real wet. This thing ain't hold no speed. All right, let's switch out that battery real quick. All right, I got a um, power hobby battery in there. 6,000 milliamps, 120C. Let's see if this make a difference. Hell yeah. Yeah, I was trying that um, cheaper battery, but it definitely didn't punch like that at all. Yeah, this outperformed the red cat. Hands down. Thing almost killed me. It's all over the place. Yeah, this thing is a beast. Oh no, what's wrong with the tire? And what I break. Ain't nothing broke. Why is it leaning? I see that right. It's like on a okay. I'm, I'm releasing on fifty percent. Oh, don't make me walk down. Okay. That's gonna make me walk down there, right? Now this thing is all over the place. Baby, I guess armor ain't that tough. Bent the pin. I don't know. I, my little thing there, I put in there myself, but it didn't hold up. It's not well. That pin is broke. That's about it. All right, the horse is up next. Yeah, the horse is running factory also. We got white lights in the front, red in the back. The horse is the last man standing. Let's see how it holds up. The thing about the horse, it's more stable. Then the big rock.
Maybe because how I lifted the big rock up makes it less stable. I can't handle the grass like that though. We're Let's see how she handles the grass. Oh no. I'm all over the place. Not as fast as the big rock, but you gotta remember that's that Traxxas VXL system in here. So it definitely can't handle like speed like that. But this thing is fun, don't get it twisted. Oh no, that that kind of tree actions. Okay, Hoss, to take this competition home, you survive this jump, and you are the champ for the day. Let's see what the horse is going to do here. Oh, well, I can't make good on the jump, but you're going to make this jump hoss. I don't know what that was. Must be a um, drive shaft, must be off for it to be riding like that. Let me check that real quick. The front is good, I mean the back is good, and the front is not. Yep, it's all the way going. So all three rigs broke on this run. I'm all done with the bash now. The big rock performed pretty good until I broke that pin right there. But that's something I put on there. It wasn't the uh, right kind of pin, so that's why it broke. Now the volcano held out perfectly. It just the tire wasn't glued all the way. That was my fault also. Now, the horse held out until the drive shaft popped off and I don't know where it's at. The thing about these cars that this need an upgraded um the upgraded tires for the volcano the horse just need an upgraded drive shaft just like most of the 3s line including the big rock i don't have a clue where that that, that um drive shaft is i should look for it because i don't think i have a replacement but all of them perform pretty good it's just the motor i got in the volcano it can only hold up to 2S. And I thought it was the ESC, so I switched it out for the Sidewinder when I had a cheaper ESC in there, but I thought it was the ESC that was so cheap it couldn't hold it. But I see now it's the motor, the Hobby Wing motor can only hold up to 2S. That's, that's it. And the 2S was a little too powerful, almost a little too powerful for it. But I'm gonna put the, um, the price of the horse is right there at the bottom of the screen. Here go the volcano. The price is at the bottom right there. 
And last but not least, the Big Rock. The price of the Big Rock is right at the bottom right there. Which one of these cards would you prefer? The Red Catch uh, Volcano is the cheapest one out the group. I'm not too sure between the, uh, I think the, uh, yeah, the um, Big Rock, I believe, is next in line for cheapest. And then the horse. But tell me what y'all think. I want to add a um, heat sink and a fan to the motor on this. And this one, I just want to upgrade the tires. I started to put some um, door tracks tires on here. And I know I should have done that before I came out. But I said, no, I'm going to run the factory tires on here to see how they hold up. And they actually didn't. They became unglued. Maybe I can glue them back together. I don't know if the rest of them came. You know, yeah, that's that's coming unglued. And I just glued these. I just glued some of them yesterday. I don't think I touched these because it was, it was glued already. So I didn't touch that. But as always, hit that like button, notification bell. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Bye.